Lord. You know what? I'm going to move and you know, be there on the side. Arrow, we're here fight week. What an atmosphere, what electricity. You said you always wanted your Vegas moment. Here you go. How you feeling? I feel great. I'm hyped up. I'm ready to go. This crowd here made me even more hyped up. I'm ready to put on a great show, great performance. I guarantee you Saturday night there's going to be a lot of blood, guts, and brains. How do you balance, you know, you're a very proud family man. How do you balance training, handling the media obligations, but also really enjoying this with your family and, and really partaking in the entire experience? It's a way of life for you me. Know? It's, it's like anything else. It's like taking a piss in the shit. This is what I do. Now with Derek James, your esteemed trainer, the trainer of the year of 2022, he's always said he feels that you're going to have to go to these deep waters. Uh, when it comes to that, uh, what are your feelings on that? I'm the big This is what I live in. I live in deep waters. When it comes to Terrence Crawford, assuming you get your hand raised on Saturday, what would it mean for you to be the first ever undisputed welterweight champion in the world in the four belt era? It means a lot. I mean, it'd be a dream come true. It's something that, as, as amateurs and as kids, you know, we watch these fights with all these great fighters. We watch De La Hoya versus Trinidad. We watch all these great fights. And now, I get to have my moment. It means the world to me. It's something I dreamed about since I was a little kid. And before before anything else, this, this is what I wanted. I wanted the glory. I wanted to be under the, the bright lights and the, and the stars. And, and have my opponent and beat my opponent, a worthy opponent, and a guy who who's, used to be former undisputed and holds a bill too, and he's undefeated too. So that makes it all much better once I defeat him come Saturday night. Do you believe that this is, you know, taking on Terrence Crawford is happening at the right time for the both of you? Uh, it definitely happening at the right time. I mean, look at the people that came out just for our grand arrival. It's definitely just even the hype, the hype around it on social media and just people talking about it. I walk in the store even before the fight was made and people asked, the first thing they asked me is when you and Terrence Crawford gonna fight. So I definitely, this fight happened at the right moment, at the right time. I feel like he's in his prime, I'm in my prime with the two best fighters at the welterweight division for one of the best fighters in the world. And then the winner Saturday night will be the best fighter in boxing, period. So this is for the mythical title, best pound for pound fighter on the planet. Definitely. Also, strap season. Give me your thoughts on now. You captured the IBF, WBC, WBA, and now you're knocking on Terrence Crawford's door to possibly capture the WBO welterweight championship of the world. I mean, it's something that I've been told people I was going to do. Regardless of, of any circumstances that happen with me, I always stay the course. I be, I be Kel Brook. I was saying strap season. Strap me up. Y'all seen it. Then I beat Sean Porter, got another strap. You know, had stuff that happened to me, but then I beat you guys, got another, another strap. And then I sat out a year and a half trying to make this fight happen with Terrence Crawford to get the other strap. So after that, I, I paid my obligation to the West Coast business. It's time to move up, and it'll be strap season all over again. Finally, Errol, how's it going down when you step inside the ring against Terrence Bud Crawford Saturday night on Showtime pay-per-view here in Las Vegas? I would definitely be victorious. I don't know how I don't know how it's gonna go. It's gonna go be a knockout, or I press him out, or I box him. Whatever it takes to win, I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna win the fight. Ladies and gentlemen, give a round of applause and go! of the world. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that'll do it here from Las Vegas for the grand arrivals. We'll see you tomorrow, 4 Eastern, 1 Pacific time for the workouts on the Showtime Sports and PDC YouTube page. So long from now, fight week with Spence and Crawford officially underway here in Las Vegas.